If you're at college or university, is it useful to look at other programming resources to help you pass that degree? Let's talk about that in today's video. Welcome back, my name is Tim Bachalka. This is another programming tip of the day. And the question was, is it useful to look for other programming resources to supplement what you're learning in your college or university degree? You know, in other words, to help understand that training. The short answer to that is that yes, it can be useful. It really depends on your lecturer and your instructor. So uh, you'll find that uh, you'll gel with people in life. Some people you'll get on well with, some people you won't get on as well. And it is possible that uh, you'll find a particular university professor, lecturer, whatever you like to call them, who you just don't gel with. In other words, you don't really, really can't really absorb the amount of information that you hope to absorb from that person. For whatever reason, they might not be the best at training, which does happen from time to time, but you may just not relate to that person. So it can be very useful in those scenarios to look for supplemental material, perhaps taking up another programming course, finding another programming book, whatever it is. And that can be useful, and it helps, uh, it shows really another perspective of what you're learning in that course. Most college university courses are well put together and well thought out, and they've been refined over the years. So they have, they, they do teach a particular, uh, or in a particular sequence in general. So it shouldn't be too hard for you to find other material that uh, gels with that or works with that to give you uh, some better skills to work with to help to hopefully help you understand that material better if you feel you need to. So by all means do that. And the other, adva other advantage of doing that is by going out and researching and looking for other material, you're starting to build those important skills that a programmer needs to do. And that's research because you'll find that uh, when you have got your first programming job and during your programming career, it's imperative for you to be able to find answers for yourself. So it's one of the things you'll actually do in your career is you'll actually pick up resources, you'll buy a book if you need to learn a particular framework, particular programming language, or you'll take a particular course. So you're setting yourself up, it's the right mindset, you're looking for the right material to help make sure you succeed in whatever your goal is. Alrighty, so I hope that helped. If you've got any questions, feel free to leave a comment and I'll get back to you. If you're ready to look at the next tip, click on up here and you can check that out. If you're interested in coding specific programming videos, click on the link in the bottom left hand corner. Consider subscribing by clicking on the link up here and I'll see you soon.